a constituency that voted leave, an MP that voted remain, a Labour majority of only 48 votes. This clearly a target for the Conservatives, but does anyone here want an election? I'm betwixt and between, to be honest about it. Betwixt and between? Yeah. An excellent way to put it. Yeah. yeah, I just don't know what to make of it, really. It would be like having another referendum, I think. I'd, I'd, rather, I'd rather get the Brexit thing sorted and then have a general election. It would be a one-issue general election. Yeah. It would basically be yeah. a referendum. And you look around you, there's other issues apart from that. I don't think it's the right way forward. What's the right way forward? I think let the Prime Minister get on with it. He's in Boris is there now, so let him do his job. That's it. Can I go now? You can go now. <laughs> In our brief and not very scientific survey of 100 locals, 49 said, bring on the election. 51 said, no thanks. There's no one really that I can say I can go and vote for, because I think with Labour, they need a better leader. And also with Tories, with what is happening. So for me at the minute, I'm just in the middle. Like, I would vote for the Brexit party if they were running. Right. Because I like Nigel Farage. And you want Brexit done? Yes. You've, you've had enough of waiting? Yes. At the local chippy, there's impatience over Brexit and not the warmest thoughts for our current batch of MPs. I think the Brexit definitely needs sorting out. It's been three years now and I can't say... I don't know anything what's happened in three years. No, I can't say anybody that could do the job sufficiently. Um, I won't say on camera what I think of who's in, no. Well, it's a free country, but keep it clean. You're not impressed. No. You're not impressed no. by any of them. It they like children arguing all the time. Instead of getting on looking after the country, they just mess about and mess about. How then to find a direction to take enough voters with you? Good luck to MPs searching for a route. Peter Lane, 5 News.